first at 11, new details about a violent evening in a South Florida neighborhood. Two men shot, one did not survive. CBS 4's Ty Russell is live at the scene in Northeast Miami-Dade with an update on what happened. Ty. Well, Francis and Elliot, at this hour, a stretch of Ives Dairy Road here is still closed. It's been this way for roughly six hours right now, and police are only calling this a shooting. However, a neighbor is saying this all stems from road rage. However, police are now still trying to figure out exactly why one man is dead and another is wounded. A busy northeast Miami-Dade intersection blocked with yellow crime scene tape Monday night. Police say it's from a deadly shooting and crash around 5.30 during the evening rush hour. A neighbor believes this stemmed from road rage along Ives Dairy Road and Highland Lakes Boulevard. Um, the, the two cars were shooting at each other. There was a white Lexus that was stuck in the middle of it. Um, he got hit by the blue car. This neighbor says this blue car was involved. It first crashed into a white Lexus and then this fence. A different neighbor surveillance camera captured two people running from it. I guess that they were scared that the person was coming after them. The people in the Lexus walked away without a scratch. They're lucky that they got out. I mean, look at them. They're standing up right now. They're, they're lucky that they got out of it. But as for the third car involved, it wasn't at this scene. Police have not said if it stopped somewhere else. It's unclear how many people were involved in total, but investigators say one man was shot in the head and later died. Another man was shot in the torso. It was released. I mean, imagine how scary it was for them. And at this late hour, we are still working to learn whether anybody is in custody. And we also want to know exactly when this road here will reopen. But for now, we are in Northeast Miami-Dade. I'm Ty Russell, CBS 4 News Tonight.